So as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe, and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for our Divine Feminines, all right? So all of our DF, Empress, High Priestess, Energy only. If you in any way at all identify as a Divine Masculine Hunty, you can go ahead and get that because this reading right now is not for you, all right? Let us go ahead, you guys, and jump right into it. Let us see what the messages are this spirit has here for you on today. Let us see. Let us see. Remember, guys, these are general readings. Only take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Okay? Thank you, spirit. What are the messages? We have passion. Okay? Children. longing all right underline the energy here is healing all right so i feel like you and your person are healing this could be the inner child this is one of you or both of you okay this person is longing for you because they have a very intense passion that they feel for you i feel like this is mutual it says try something you've never done before okay so in some way here you're stepping outside of your comfort zone yeah old wounds and childhood issues need revisiting okay so that's what they're dealing with childhood wounds all right chemistry the attraction you feel is mutual new love a new love or recommitment to love is developing okay so that's what's taking place here let's dig a little bit more what is the vibe all right so zaddy feels a little bit curved right now okay or this could be you that feels curved by them all right let us see put yourself on whichever side you go dms okay new message interested secret admirer again this person is longing for you you may not know this or believe it but they are all right a lot of you feel like this person continually makes excuses okay let us see let us see messages here we have dtf okay single free spirit many options okay so this person is single i don't feel like they're in a relationship with someone okay let's see messages for feminine sneaky link okay so they just want to keep it on a dl okay that's what it feels like they want to keep it on a dl or you do okay let us see third will okay you feel like there's other people well maybe i feel like they're single okay you're single or they're single somebody is single maybe both of you okay so um that's what it should be <laughs> both of you are single so it's like yeah it is what it is okay now i'm not really sure but this person is upset for whatever reason or another yeah i feel like this person wants to come towards you and they want a commitment like it says a uh, new person new love or recommitment right and we have many options so somebody is wanting something and the other person seems to be wanting something else okay or something like that one of you wants to be in a relationship and the other one is keeping their options open or something like that all right let us see messages for feminine okay i'm just going to take all of these because they came out or both of these <laughs> getting to know each other in unrequited love okay so the more that you get to know this person some of you feel like okay it is unrequited it's not enough chemistry it's not enough love yes i love them yes i care about them and then you know you're like what else so this could be why you're keeping your options open here okay let us see again put yourself whichever side you go all right keep an open mind it says your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations so again it's something here about it. You just may do things different or you express yourself in different ways or something about that. But it says give your relationship a chance, okay? So, hmm. Spirit is like trust this process. Take your time. Get to know each other. Be open-minded, okay? Let us see. Whoa. It's a lot. You got to free yourself and express your love. So someone holds back. Okay, this could be because they're still connected to someone else. They could have child or children with this person. Okay, maybe that's why it's coming out like that. We have flirt and wedding. So ultimately, this is what it's going to lead to. Okay, this person is looking for something long term. They just have a hard time expressing themselves right now because they have things that they're still releasing or something like that. 
or this is you. Put yourself whichever side you go again, all right? But that's what I'm picking up on. Let us see. Somebody needs to release their ex, okay? They're in the process of doing this right now. We have Temperance and we have Queen of Swords, all right? So Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, Sagittarian energy, okay? Doesn't have to be. Someone's patience is being tested is how they feel right now. This could be you or your person. I'm just going to keep saying that because I want you to be like, no, that's them. Okay, put yourself whichever side. All right, let us see. Messages for feminine. We have temperance in reverse. Okay, so yeah, you've lost your patience with the situation. They love you, okay? They just may not be ready or they may not see themselves as this emperor or something like that. The Queen of Cups. So this prevents you from opening yourself up to this person. But they're very curious about where this is going to go. They just don't feel ready for maybe everything that you're ready for in this moment. Nine of Swords in Reverse, King of Swords. This is the truth. It's not something for you to feel bad about or them to feel bad about. If a person is not ready, they're not ready. We got Four of Swords here. This is them aiming to manifest you and pull you in. Like I said, some of you have blocked this person out. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles in Reverse. They keep reaching out and I feel like you're just like, no, thank you. <laughs> or something. The star card in reverse. Some of them could be stuck in a karmic situation. That could also be what the free yourself and unrequited love is about. They could be in an unrequited situation, a karmic situation. Yeah, devil. That's hard for them to leave um, due to child or children or something like that. Okay, but let us see. Okay, we have the nine of pentacles. Yeah, this is single. So they are single, but they're still very much so attached to that person. Okay, is what I'm getting. Yeah, we got the king of wands here. Okay, and we have the Wheel of Fortune. But this is them taking accountability where they can and where they need to, where they should. Taking action, taking steps as they're guided to so that this relationship can move forward and progress. Okay, they would like to see this steadily progress, even if they're not quite ready for everything you're ready for at this moment. Okay. Five of Swords in reverse. Okay. They just don't want to lose you. That's what it boils down to because, yeah, they feel like you're a match. King of Wands, Queen of Wands, Three of Swords in reverse. Oh, they just have some delays that prevent them from coming towards you. Some of them may be battling some addictions or some habits, uh, like drinking, alcoholism, okay? Temperance in reverse. Let us see. Okay, we have the two of wands in reverse. Yeah. So some of you have just decided to remove yourself from the situation and not allow a rebirth. You're staying focused on what you're focused on. Queen of Pentacles, all right, Queen of Swords. Like I said earlier, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, again, okay, Seven of Wands. You are determined to, hmm, have what you want. So it's like, look, nobody is wrong here. If the person is not ready for what you're ready for, okay. And if you are ready for something and it's not with them, okay. You get what I'm saying? So maybe this is just what they're upset about. You know, they want things to be different, but they're just not, right? We got the five of wands in reverse. You're not arguing. You're not going back and forth. You're not doing any of the low vibrational stuff. You're just focused on building yourself up. Your nine of pentacles are ready. So the plan is to get to the ten of pentacles, right? Uh, whether it be with, like, them or someone else, like I said. <laughs> yeah, six of pentacles in reverse. So with them observing this connection they feel like it has been very one-sided because again they feel like you're able to give more than they're able to give right now or something like that we have the magician here in the four of swords like i said they're aiming to manifest you or pull you in all right seven of swords in reverse i feel like they want to reveal what it is that they really want you know they just don't want to tell you and then have you expecting it right now. Because, again, they're not in that energy of giving it to you right now. They have to release some things first. All right. Nine of Pentacles. Just because a person is single doesn't mean that they have no strings at all anywhere. Right. They got some strings somewhere. We got the Page of Cups in reverse. Ace of Cups in reverse. Now, is that relationship going to start again or start back up? No. I see the world card. You know, it's something about it that was very burdensome. It's a relationship that's over. It could be like one of those things where you know that you and somebody are done, but you're trying that last little, you know what I mean? Like y'all already separated, but you're just trying that last little time before you be like, you know what, for real, for real, never mind. 
this I'm good on this, you know, or something like that. It could be what's going on. Yeah, we got the two of cups, all right? They're single, but they do love you. Are they ready for, like, the highest level of commitment at this time? No. Is that eventually what they would like? Yes. Okay, so hope it's making sense. Let us see. We got the king of wands and the will of fortune. Death card reverse. They don't want it to be over because they do feel like this is meant to be. They just want you to see it from their point of view as well. Understand that they're building themselves back up, building their energy back up, building their livelihood back up, um, building their health back up after a very toxic situation with the Ten of Swords and the Moon. Okay, so this may be something they were embarrassed about and didn't necessarily want to tell you, but that's what's going on. All right, we got the Five of Swords in reverse. Let us see. Five of Swords in reverse. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, okay, so this person does not feel good when you guys are not in contact or not in communication again two of cups and the lovers they feel you're their twin flame soulmate so are they ready for that again immediately right now no would they like to work their way up to that with you yes queen of pentacles king of pentacles you know king of wands queen of wands you guys are a match okay um however they're just not ready for like the husband role right now the father role right now they got things going on that they need to heal and sort out okay that's what i'm seeing Let's pick some more here for our feminines. Yeah, we got pause and cycles. Okay, so pause for a hot second. Let this person handle what they need to handle. Of course, it does not mean you have to wait if you do not want to. Okay, that's just blue informing you as to what's going on. So let us see what are the messages here for our feminines. Thank you, spirit. Okay, we have hidden path. All right, detour, slow down, explore, go in a new direction. So, yeah, slow down. Don't be afraid to get to know each other a little bit more. Some of you feel like, oh, I know this person for 55 years. Okay, spirit is still saying go slow, take your time. And also remember, take what messages resonate with you personally, right? But it says stay grounded in the now. Don't look at what happened before. Some of you should try journaling perhaps, okay, to contemplate your feelings. All right. Yeah, all right, let us see. We have control. This person could be releasing control issues because, again, we have anger issues here. Okay, appreciate they're doing some sort of healing. I like, all right, something that they need to heal. Appreciate, appreciate your twin. They appreciate you. Okay, rise above the need to be petty or the desire to be petty okay yeah this person is watching you we said that earlier with the page of swords we have observed here watching you on social media very curious as to what you're doing okay again they feel like this is a blessing all right they're just leveling up getting closer to spirit healing themselves working through fear working with ego okay healing these things about themselves in order to be this emperor that a lot of you see them as in order to prepare themselves for union okay but yeah until then they're going to keep hesitating and they don't want to put you through that because they're healing so no they're not going to just jump into it they're going to allow themselves the time to heal as they should all right so if this was your reading or you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up and if you have not already go ahead and subscribe peace and hair grease